Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to talk about the third and last exotic in Season 19, which will be the Dungeon Exotic that will be arriving on Friday. So if you don't want any spoilers, please click off this video. But for those who want to know what the, this last exotic is, it's really awesome. So we're going to go into that, but be sure to subscribe and like because it will mean a lot. But of course, like I said earlier, Today we've been wrapping and talking about all the exotics. We talked about the exotic SMG and how to get its catalyst. We then furthermore talked about some of the info we know on the exotic pulse rifle that will be releasing on December 20th with an exotic mission. And finally there's going to be an exotic same of how season 17 with the duality dungeon there will be an exotic sword there. And we can follow that this next dungeon will have the same format. Now it has been confirmed by Destiny 2 leaks that this exotic will be a hundred percent RNG there's no quest resulted into that so again like I said it's following that same format and JP Deathblade did say on Twitter what this is so big credit to him go check him out he's an awesome guy but the dungeon bow will be called the heresy of needs now what is the exotic perk and what is the intrinsic perk well the exotic perk basically says that precision hits and final blows with this bow build guidance ring energy Opposing Guardians grant additional energy at full charge. Hip firing creates a guidance ring. So we don't know really what all that means just from that exotic example, uh, from that intrinsic trait. But I'm guessing it will be something building up, of course, energy from getting kills. And then when you switch to firing mode, you will be able to build up all that energy for some type of guidance ring type of attack. I was trying to think something maybe similar to Black Talon, but that really isn't like a good example. I was just thinking of something that builds up to a, uh, you know, a big attack. But a guidance ring is something that I really don't know what to define, really, because I don't know an exact picture for it. But the intrinsic perk, the other trait for it, is called, I don't even know how to say it, but basically it says, Arrows fired through a guidance ring release seeking projectiles, which do more damage based on the distance traveled. So with this guidance ring, I'm kind of getting a Well of Radiance type of vibe. And then of course one of the perks is, is once you finally place it down and then bow shot within that ring, will turn into projectiles or do enough damage similar to projectiles, probably something to maybe servitor, uh, you know, to servitors or something like that, and then those projectiles will, of course, do a lot of damage, and of course, be on how much distance that projectile is traveling towards the enemy. So there's not a lot to be given with this, just with the exotic perk and the intrinsic perk alone, but just coming out of it, seeing how awesome, you know, seeing how interesting it is, it's something to look at. It's definitely a cool bow, and it is a solar bow, and we already have Tiku's Divination, so there's definitely going to be a lot of comparisons once this comes out to Tiku's and to other bows, but it's just interesting to me, at least, to find out that we're getting another bow, but in some type of, you know, will of rage type vibe. It's like getting kills to get this guidance ring and then the projectiles fired within it will do more damage. Moreover, this exotic will follow the same format, like I said earlier, to what the duality dungeon did. So it, me telling you it's going to be an RNG drop is probably not a surprise, but remember, similar to how duality's triumphs in the seal, as this dungeon will have a seal, you will be able to, of course, do the challenges and triumphs within the seal that will increase the chances as Heart Shadow was increased for your chances if you did those challenges in Duality back in Season of the Haunted. So please be aware of that so don't think your chances are so gone. Again, time will tell. We, of course, have this. This will launch on Friday, which is in like three days from now. So it's going to be very interesting on how this exotic pulls out. But I just wanted to make a quick video. Of course, huge credit to JB Deathblade for, of course, you know, showing this information on Twitter. But yeah, guys, hope you guys did enjoy. Subscribe and like, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.